real estate mogul, Jeff Green, from selling circus tickets to selling real estate. Jeff Green's life story is a testament to the power of perseverance, ambition, and the relentless pursuit of success. Born in 1954 in Worcester, Massachusetts, to a working-class Jewish family, his early years were far from glamorous. However, what he lacked in privilege, he more than made up for with determination and grit. The Green family's fortunes took a downturn when Jeff's father faced a business setback, prompting them to relocate to Florida in 1970. It was there that young Jeff Green would embark on his journey to transform his life and achieve his dreams. In Florida, his parents took on jobs that were far removed from their previous life. His father found himself refilling vending machines, while his mother worked tirelessly as a waitress. Joining us now, the billionaire investor, Jeff Green. Jeff, it's great to see you. Welcome. Good morning, Robert. Jeff Green understood that if he wanted a brighter future, he would have to carve it out for himself. Determined to pursue higher education, Green worked a myriad of jobs to put himself through college at Johns Hopkins University. Despite the financial challenges, he pressed on and graduated in just three years with a BA. In economics and sociology, his resilience and dedication didn't go unnoticed, as he earned scholarships and took on part-time jobs, even teaching Hebrew three days a week. But Green's journey was far from over. His relentless pursuit of success took him on an extraordinary path, one that began with his very first source of income, selling circus tickets. Long before his days at Harvard Business School, young Jeff Green embarked on cross-country trips to sell tickets to the circus. In those early days, while many of his peers might have been content with ordinary part-time jobs, Green's ambition pushed him to explore unconventional opportunities. Armed with his unwavering determination and a knack for salesmanship, he crisscrossed the country, from one town to the next, peddling circus tickets to eager spectators. This experience not only honed his sales skills but also instilled in him a resilience that would prove invaluable in his future endeavors. Yet, as Green set his sights on higher education and the dream of attending Harvard Business School, he faced a unique challenge, funding his education. Many might have been discouraged by the daunting costs of such a prestigious institution, but not Jeff Green. He viewed this obstacle not as a roadblock but as an opportunity waiting to be seized. Rather than letting financial constraints deter him from his academic aspirations, Green decided to leverage his entrepreneurial spirit and the knowledge he had gained from his ticket-selling days. With a sharp business acumen and a determination to create his own path, he began investing in real estate during his time at Harvard. In 1977, during his studies at the renowned business school, he made a pivotal move. Jeff Green purchased his very first property, a humble three-family house. However, he didn't merely use it as a residence. Instead, he transformed the property, remodeling it to accommodate fellow students, and began renting out rooms. I mean, people say that you think it's, I wasn't sleeping in my car, but that was my base. Yeah. So now, and a lot of I, you know people I knew had bought, I had, had invested in real estate. A friend of mine from Hopkins said, "What do I do?" And he said, "Well, what you can do is why don't you go buy one of these three three deckers? What's that? It's like a three-family house. You can live in one, rent out the other two, and." the end of the time you think you'll probably be able to sell and get your money back and live rent free. I'm saying, that's interesting. This not only provided him with a place to live but also served as a profitable venture that helped fund his education. By the time he graduated from Harvard Business School, Jeff Green had already cultivated a substantial real estate portfolio, owning a total of 18 properties. His journey from selling circus tickets to amassing a significant real estate empire is a testament to his resilience, innovative thinking, and unyielding determination. Green's story demonstrates that setbacks and financial constraints need not define our future. With a creative mindset, a strong work ethic, and the courage to turn challenges into opportunities, we can overcome any obstacle in our path. Jeff Green's life story continues to inspire those who dare to dream big, reminding us that success is within reach for those who refuse to be limited by circumstances and instead, choose to create their own destiny. A key note is the fact that how we see our circumstances will impact how we deal with each obstacle. Seeing our challenges as an opportunity to use our creativity is a trait that everyone with a desire for success should cultivate. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, leave a comment, inspire a friend, share the video and most definitely subscribe.
we will see you in our next video, with more inspirational real-life stories to help you continue on your journey to greatness.